What is up everybody? My name is Justin. This is Forever Self Employed and in today's video we are going to be doing something special. We're going to be attempting to restore a fence. I saw a video on YouTube and it looked like this. I'm ready to soft wash this fence. This is a low pressure cleaning technique using a special cleaning solution. And watch this transformation. And as you can see, it's right now transforming and uh, it's totally changing the finish of this in a matter of a minute or two. So hopefully we can recreate that. I'm about to show you guys the setup, but basically in a few days, it's gonna be 4th of July. And as you can see, the neighbors have a brand new fence. Now, we can't be having the neighbors outshine my mama, you know? So we're gonna help mama out today. We're gonna see if we can't clean this fence behind me right here. I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys my setup, but basically we're gonna do something sort of like a soft wash. Now, um, I'm not doing my own chemical mixture. I'm actually gonna use a 30 second cleaner. I heard that was the best on fences. So we're gonna give it a go um, and see if it can work out i've tried this before i tried it with the soap cannon but unfortunately it didn't work the first time i don't know if you guys remember it but i'll leave a link to the video right here if you guys want to check it out um but if you could go ahead and hit that subscribe button for me go ahead and hit the like button for me i'm almost at 10,000 subscribers when i do hit 10,000, it will unlock the merch i will have merch dropping at 10k subscribers so make sure you hit the subscribe button for me i really appreciate it let's go ahead and get into my setup for this fence cleaning i also want to add that this could be a potential business uh, i don't see many people advertising for fence cleaning i think there's probably potentially a market out there for it for it is probably untapped so if this does work it could potentially be a valuable income source revenue stream all kind of business opportunity so let's see if we can't get this to work so here's my setup uh we got the pressure washer right here i have a bucket uh this is going to be my siphon and it's i'm going to put chemical in here um, and like I said, I'm gonna be using the 30 second outdoor cleaner. I heard that was the best on fences. Uh, you can probably also use a pool essentials and soap mixture as well, just a regular soft wash mix. But I'm just gonna be trying the 30 second cleaner just for this video. Um, and like I said, here's the siphon. I'm gonna put that in there. And then I'm also gonna be using a black tip as you can see here on the pressure washer. So that way it's a soap tip. So it's gonna be a soft wash and not with pressure. Now, if I have to use pressure after I apply it, then I will. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna apply it. I'm gonna let it sit for a few seconds and then uh, we're gonna take it off. So let's go ahead and power this up and see uh, what it's gonna do. So I went ahead and put in the, all the 30 second cleaner. It says fast acting, safe, uh, algae, mold, and mildew. I'm gonna leave a link for this in the comment section and the description, the link for all my setup as well in the comment section and the description. But I might have to use a little bit more. I don't know if this is gonna be enough. Um, and basically this says that it needs to be diluted, but whenever it siphons into here, it's gonna mix with the water. And so that'll dilute it down enough. So let's go ahead and crank it up. All right, everybody, uh, commentary Justin back again. So let's be honest, the guy from the first clip is probably some type of wizard because that magic potion that he put on the fence to make the algae and mildew disappear, I've not been able to recreate, but I'm on a mission to recreate it for you guys because if you could just imagine, if you could clean fences that quickly and you were able to charge a couple hundred dollars to do a fence job, I mean, you could make easily a couple hundred dollars in just an hour, maybe two. So 
I'm going to make this a series until I can figure out exactly how to soft wash fences really quickly. Uh, I won't rest, okay? I am on the clock and I am on a mission and I am not going to rest until I figure this solution out. So once I put the solution, once I put the soft wash chemicals, um, the 30 second miracle mix, whatever that was, once I put it on the fence, I let it sit there for a few minutes and I came back and I switched my tip. I switched it over to the green tip. I figured I would kind of do light pressure on it just to see if it will come off and it didn't come off that easily it came off a little bit somewhat but i still as you can see in this video i'm still putting pressure on it which is um you know kind of a disappointment because i was really hoping that this was going to work but my next place that i'm going to go to is i'm probably just going to put straight bleach on the fence when i watched the video i checked the description i checked the comment section there was no chemical mixture listed i don't know if the fence he was working on was tainted or what it was but if you guys have a chemical mixture definitely leave it down in the comment section before for me like i said this is going to be a series until i can figure out how we can quickly wash fences so consider this part one in the series because like i said i'm on a mission man if i can figure this out we are all going to make a ton of money um and i'm going to show you guys my advertisements and y'all can copy it and we can all get filthy rich so make sure you hit that like button for me if you haven't already because i'm trying to unlock the code to everlasting fences if you will um so yeah as you can see right here i'm just pressure washing this uh fence and the only thing I, I dislike about the wood too is is if you guys have ever pressure washed wood before you're basically cutting into the wood like if you don't maintain the same distance apart from the fence then you will get streaks like some parts will be lighter than other parts and that's because you're kind of cutting into the wood so if you can figure out how to just do it with soft wash i think that's going to be the key so like i said if anyone has the soft wash crabby patty miracle formula please leave it down for me in the comment section um so i just messed this up i had it in front of me i was doing the commentary over the video but anyway uh, my name is justin this is forever self-employed if you guys would like to support me i have amazon links down below you can purchase anything through the links and i will get a small commission it has to be within 24 hours if you'd like to sponsor the channel i have a patreon feel free to sponsor me on that like i said this is a series this is part one and until i find the remedy i will not sleep maybe just a little uh but like i said my name is justin this is forever self-employed until next time hustle hard get that money baby peace